Hey everybody, it's Steve Hodges, and here we are at the RGA Expo 2019. And I forgot your name. Rebecca Gregory. Rebecca? Yes. So tell us a little bit about what you do. So I am the founder of Rebecca's Angels Foundation. I am a Boston Marathon bombing survivor. In 2013, my five-year-old son and I were three feet away from the first bomb that went off at the marathon. He was sitting on my feet that day with his back up against uh, my shins, and all of everything, the backpack was behind us, and everything that came from the backpack, I took in the back of the legs, the torso, and the left hand, and that's what saved my son's life. Um, See, I wasn't really prepared for this. <laughs> well, that's, I, I think is, I told the story so much, I'm kind of like getting flustered myself. You I mean, know, it, it is, but everyone has things that happen in their lives, and I always say that the majority of people will never get blown up by a bomb, but everyone has life blow up in their face. And the reason that Rebecca's Angels Foundation came about is to help in the aftermath of that. You know, the physical was not the worst part, even though I lost my left leg below the knee. I've had 68 operations as a result of the bombing. Uh, but the worst part was that my son, my five-year-old son, no longer wanted to leave the house. He no longer wanted to interact with the world or get back on his bike or go to kindergarten because of everything he saw. You know, when those brothers packed those pressure cooker bombs full of nails and babies and ball bearings and all of that, and, and people's body parts were laying all around us. My left leg was on fire. My bones were laying next to me on the sidewalk. That affects me every day, but more importantly, that's what my five-year-old saw. Yeah. Well, wow, that's just incredible. So if people that watch this video want to know how to find out more, is there a website? It is. So it's RebeccasAngelsFoundation.org. Um, RebeccasAngelsFoundation.org. Yes. I think I can find it. <laughs> yes. And what we do is provide mental health treatment for children and their families struggling through trauma. So there's so many different things that fall under the umbrella of trauma, whether it be a divorce, a car accident, an illness, a type of injury. And people don't realize a lot of times that children are really suffering more than you originally think because children are not as resilient as we all have learned that they are. Um, that's actually very false. And people can have memories as early as, you know, two years old that they this sticks with them and it creates really proper, a lot of problems long term. So what we're trying to do is, is get to the heart of that, get to the root of the problem and really help these kids and their families so they yeah. can go on and lead their next chapter of life. So give us that website one more time. It's Rebecca'sAngels.org. I said foundation. And it's Rebecca'sAngels.org. Rebecca'sAngels.org. Yes. Okay, Rebecca's Angels .org. So Well, listen, thank you so much. It's a pleasure to get to meet yes, you. Yes, thank you so much. And well, Tiffany, yes. Tiffany, thank you so much. Thank you. It's great the work that you're doing. I love it. Well, we're just happy to be here. We're excited. Right. So. Thank you so much for the interview. Thank you.